but all I want to do is lay in bed and watch YouTube videos like all I've been doing lately is like streaming documentaries TV series like I have been watching the hills the hills the hills you guys I've been watching the hills and just making fun of like the way they dress or the way I used to dress because I used to like watch that show when I was like around 12 and I would be like oh my god like their sense of style is so cool <laughs> and I remember like some outfits some questionable outfits that I used to wear that that show reminds me of it was like a good um it was a good show that I used to love um but I have so much shit to do and I don't want to do any of it and i feel like i've kind of like gotten by the last two weeks just because like i've been really good at scheduling and i've like scheduled everything ahead in time and now it's kind of like now i need to actually work i have to answer emails i have to answer emails you guys like i have to um everything everybody's going back to work and it's kind of like the like I've been used to like having chill days where like nobody talks to me to now like people sending me emails every other hour like asking stuff or like I mean I say asking stuff but it's basically like pitching for like new campaigns, new projects, etc. which is so cool like it's actually really cool and I'm happy and I'm excited to get back to work but I don't have the motivation to do it and I'm so mad at myself so I don't know what I need to do. I know what I have to do. I know what I need to do. So I'm just gonna sit at my desk, put my headphones on, and force myself to work for like two hours. Just two hours. I'm telling myself, give yourself two hours, get as much work done as you possibly can in the next two hours. And then I need to get ready, look a little bit more presentable like a human being, um, put something cute on and like take some pictures because I really need new content on my page like I feel like if I don't everybody's just gonna follow me and be like you're trash anyways we don't like you I mean I wouldn't follow me because I'm so trash at like posting like I've got so much new shit that I need to like shoot content with but then I'm like I don't have the motivation to do any of it but today I'm gonna shoot a little bit and then hopefully that will get the ball rolling on the rest of the content that I want to shoot and then also I need to film some videos next week um so I need to get started on shooting content like I have so much shit to do you guys and I just want to lay in bed and not do any of it but like that's not realistic so I need to get to work I'm gonna catch you guys later I'm gonna cry I'm not gonna cry but Speaking of crying, I haven't cried in a week. Like, I've literally not cried in a week, which is, like, so random for me and so weird. Like, I literally cry every other day. Like, it's just normal for me to cry. Like, I just find reasons to cry about every and anything. Like, I'm such a sentimental person, so I cry a lot. And, like, especially if I watch something or if I talk to someone or if I'm in my feelings, if, I, if I'm angry, whatever, I cry. So I cry a lot. And I haven't cried in, like, the last week, which I find is weird, but at the same time, I'm like... I don't know. I don't know what it is. Maybe I'm just like gonna have like a big crying session at the like over the weekend or something. I'm just gonna have like a big crying session where I'm gonna cry a lot for like three hours or something. Maybe it's like just building up and then I'm just gonna burst into tears <laughs> one day and just like I'm gonna go right now because I'm procrastinating by telling you guys about my crying habits. 
Ta-da! I got a new chair. I'm so happy with it too. I bought it from Ikea. And I just love the legs and how sleek it is. It's so, so pretty and minimal. And it goes so well with my room. It's for my desk, but for now I'm just keeping it here because I was reading here yesterday. I also got these see-through curtains that my friend Rena recommended I get. She said that my room needs curtains and I said I hate curtains and then she said just get see-through ones and she was right. And I'm obsessed with them. They're super lightweight. They're also from Ikea. And then we've got a new candle here burning. This one is from Oppa, which is the restaurant. They sent me the cutest PR package. And this was one of the items that they sent me. And it's pink, by the way, the candle. So cute. Um, what else? These are the only two things that I added to my room. And yeah, I also need to clean my mirror because it's dirty, but my curls are out today. And I have to like kind of swoop them to the side because my bangs are getting too long and like covering my eyes. So I have to like put them like that to the side like an emo kid procrastinating she's procrastinating and you know what's funny you guys like every time i get a comment or a dm or something like oh you motivate me i'm like if you see what state i'm in right now you would not be motivated by me like i am the queen of procrastination lately and it needs to stop it really needs to stop like i can't live like this anymore i can't just be in bed watching shit like i need to get a life i need to get my shit together it's later on in the day and I look slightly different because I had to refresh my curls and I had to put on some makeup for um, some content that I had to shoot today um, and I'm starving haven't had lunch so I'm about to dig in this is what I'm eating for lunch it's like a new favorite it's literally pesto pasta or like pesto spaghetti and then I just like cut um, cherry tomatoes and then just put it in the sauce while i'm like mixing everything together and it's so so good so i'm about to dig in and probably watch something i'm gonna watch i may destroy you which is like a series that i found recently um it's so so good i highly recommend it i think there are only like two episodes out now i'm watching the third one while i eat but it's such such a good show especially if you want to watch more series with like black female leads I am done with dinner. I decided that I'm gonna go on a little walk. I've got my Adidas mask. I just got it the other day. I'm so happy I got it. This is what it looks like. As you guys can see, it covers the entire, it covers like literally all of my face. And the other day I went out and I wasn't even wearing makeup and I got away with it. Anyways, I'm gonna go for a walk. I've got my headphones with me. I'm gonna listen to some music. Just like for 30 minutes before curfew because we have curfew at 11. It's like 9.30 right now. So I'm gonna go for like a 30 minute walk. Clear my head a little bit, get some fresh air. And then I'll come back and I'll shower. Take off my makeup and get ready for bedtime. <laughs>
so good after a long long day of just like working going on a walk that felt amazing so i'm still using the same nighttime routine i'm gonna make sure to link it below in case our you're wondering what products I'm using. Um, the only product that I've replaced was my night cream. I switched back to the La Mer. If you guys used to watch my older vlogs, you'll know that I used to use this as a nighttime routine before and I switched to the Origins one. And honestly, nothing is better than this, so I switched back. It's just so moisturizing. And I see the difference when I wake up in the morning. Forget your Vaseline. And we're done. Okay, I'm gonna go back to the room, get something to wear, and I don't know what else I'm gonna vlog. I've got a few PR packages. Are you guys interested in that? I'm gonna vlog it for you guys anyways. <laughs> I only got two PR packages. I think I got these yes no, I got this yesterday and I got this today. So I'm gonna open this one for you guys first because it's super cute. It's from this brand that I don't know how to pronounce. Is it Nooks? Nooks. I don't know. I don't know. Don't judge me. Anyways, so they sent me this cute little package and I'm tired, so bear with me. This is an all-purpose oil. I used to have this before, and I used it till it ran out. It's so good. Like, especially if you want to, like, go out and show your legs, and you, you want to put a little bit of oil on your legs, this is fantastic, and it smells really good. Um, and then there is a hand cream. I'm just going to put it in my bag when I go out. And then there's a candle. Thank you, Nyx. However you pronounce the brand. Um, but I love candles, so. And this one smells really good. I'm excited to burn this. And then we also got... Okay, there we go. Lip balm. Let me open it for you guys. Honey is an amazing ingredient for, like, moisture. So, this is the lip balm. I'm going to apply a little bit. I'm going to apply a little bit on my lips it smells really good the last item in this PR box is honey they literally put a jar of honey which you know you can't be mad at honey is always good to have in the kitchen so that's that for the next package we got a package from carefree which is convenient because I am on my period in case you haven't noticed been so moody today they sent me three packets of panty liners this one is cotton this one is cotton aloe Ooh. and then this one is also cotton um so there's like a pack of 20 pack of 30 and pack of 30 which is gonna be great because i'm on my period yes <laughs> um but anyways they also attached um, some information about the product and then some ooh, 21 pink day challenge ooh, this is gonna be fun to try um, and then a notebook like a journal and a pen it says let's do it guys I'm so out of it but this is such a cute package I know I don't sound excited, but I'm really excited. I'm just really tired. So these are the packages that I got. I'm going to meditate and journal. I got my phone so I can like listen to a guided meditation. And then this new notebook that I'm going to basically use to 
um, journal with, <laughs> they attach these cute little stickers. I don't think I'm gonna use them tonight, um, but it'll be cute to like put around. So yeah, gonna meditate and journal for a bit. Mm -hmm.